Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. Today we have a what do you call this? Um Goodwill haul. So I actually decided to go um to Goodwill after our rock. Rock is a sport that you actually walk um with a weighted backpack. And I do that with a bunch of veterans every Sunday. So, if you live downtown, you are more than you can come, blah, blah, blah. Message me if you do, downtown Detroit. So, let me show you what I got. First, I got this, like, really, really nice, both of these are from the Goodwill by Merriman Road. So, anyhow, they are very heavy. They are both brass, and I believe it is like a girl with a basket sitting. I just love the patina. And then it's just a taper candle. Super old. I don't know what that is. So this is the other one. Again, super. I love that patina. I love that. And you can whack your, your husband with it. No. <laughs> but anyhow... Those were $20, and I just thought I loved them, so I picked it up. On the same Goodwill, I also picked up, let me just show you guys. Um, Alright. Goodwill. So I have to go to the Burbies to actually get a Goodwill. And they are kind of nice. So, anyhow, I picked up this really nice Viking Edge vase, the vase, 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 bud vase. And you can see, like, they even have the tag right there. So, super nice. It needs, all, obviously, a little cleaning. I love that, um, what is that? Transfer wear, I believe. And it is artist sign. See? super cool and uh these were $3.99 so i said to myself yep that's gonna go home with me and then this is the other one that i picked up yeah this is the receipt so it is nope that's not it this one so yeah this is the one it's on middle belt road so um okay so the other one that i picked up sorry is this mccoy um planter right here so these are $14 or $15. So that's kind of like retail, but I don't have this. I have two that are very special to me because it was gifted to me by one of my dear friends. And it, it's her mom's um, planter. So I, I love her face. And then no chips, no crack. So super big. Had to figure out what I'm doing with that. Those ones don't have drainage hole, and I normally don't put drainage hole on my because um, I don't want to ruin the pottery. And then on to Canton. So in Canton, I saw this beautiful plant stand right here. These are $9. It's very solid, and it has a stamp that it says, Handcrafted by M.W. Stuff Grish Rush Ray. Right there. So I'm very excited to actually put a plant on it. Put a plant on it on that one. It's super heavy and super tall. And I like that the feet are actually um, wood. So yeah, for 10 bucks, I picked that up. And then the other two that I picked up at the Canton one, because I didn't realize that I was so close to that area, so I went. 
um, they have this really nice, yeah, this is uh, Royal Copley, dun, 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 dun. and it is a transfer wear vase, and these are $6. So this is a bit pricey, but I cannot leave it behind just because of the handles. I just love it. There you go. And then I got another McCoy. And I will show you guys. Boom, ba -da -da. And I have a big, big one of this. I think it's downstairs. It's kind of like a pitcher. It has that gold kind of like thing. It is $6.99. I love the form. And then, as you can see, they're marked USA. Ah, I don't know if you guys can see. But there you go. It is marked USA. So I went ahead and picked that up. So those are our lovable Goodwill finds. And then I was walking out of the Canton one. And then they have obviously display when you enter. And I have to stop, look, and listen, of course. So I picked up this one. I don't know when I would see that. It's probably in my purse. So they have this huge hall pottery USA coffee mug decanter whatever. And that's the mug. So the comps on this one I looked it up it's about like for between 89 to uh, 35 dollars so for six bucks yay please so I'm gonna put that right there so and then I did not know that this exists but they have like what do you call that place oh right here volunteers of America so this was pretty exciting so um let me show you guys what i have so we're gonna start off first with this so i found these these are actually regular product price but it's still cheaper so when i found these they have so many junks that they put in here so they have this like really nice teapot. It is extremely dirty because for whatever stupid reason, they they decorated it like stupid. I don't know why people do that. Probably because they're expressing themselves. But they put like some glue, like some um, hot glue on it. So they put like um, fake flowers with fall whatever and I'm like no no don't do that these teacups are hand painted it's probably not expensive it's probably like in mint condition if I can get this all of these junkiness out um, and I'm trying to take it out in this video I shouldn't but anyhow I purchased them for four dollars so they are Rosina Fine China made in England and it is the November and November is special to me because that is my mother's birth year but let's talk about how beautiful that um, hand painted design is and it has a gold thing on there and this at one point was in a uh, shop because see they have this thing right here but anyhow, um, take this out. So they had some fake, oh, it was, to me, it was heartbreaking just because of like what teacups meant to me, like certain teacups, of course. But um, yeah, I was really annoyed about that. So that's the markings right there. See, they have a tag. They have this brown junk right here so hopefully i can take that out they have like faux flowers 
glued right here see you can see the blue residue so I'm really hoping that I could revive this so I can put it on my um, my collection because see how beautiful that is super stunning in the hand too it's nice so yep pick that up and then um the color so they have color stuff too this lady is so nice she tapes them they're extremely awesome there but I've, that's my first time so hopefully my experience is always awesome but we shall see they have a lot of furniture a lot of clothes the color for the week is 50% off if it's a blue tag. And um, if it's red tag, it's 75% off. And so, I saw this beautiful vase right here. This is like reverse painted, I believe. But see how stunning that is? Super awesome. It is not milk glass. These were marked at $6.99 but they were half off so i got this for three dollars and fifty cents and that is a steal of a deal i don't think that there's any markings on this that i know of yeah there's no markings in the bottom but it is just a very stunning piece so yep 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 so I picked that up, put that right here, and then the next piece was, this one is not even my color, but because they were green tag, I had to pick it up, Obsess. you know, you guys know, okay. So they have this like beautiful glass right over here. See, if you look closely, you would see that there's a bunch of like scratches right here and right here, but still stunning with the flowers. I'm thinking about gifting this to Miss Tracy if she likes it, but also this is going to be a nice like cheese platter. So they were asking five, um, 505 on this one. But like I said, the red tags were 75% off. So, therefore, it took off $3 and $3. She marked, okay. $3 and um, some cents. I think she charged me for this one twice. Ugh, I should pay attention more when I'm checking out because remember last week that consignment shop oh but that's okay all right oh because there's two of them okay I got it okay sorry I'm just an idiot so I found this really nice bowl I I think that this one is like a thing for and it is Hager. Ta-da! My favorite pottery. Um, this is transferred. They're not, um, what do you call this? Uh, hand painted. I'm thinking this is uh, like a pitcher thing, like so. But they didn't have the pitcher. So I had to find the pitcher. But anyhow, it is red. It is 404. That's why I got two 404 in there, but I still pick it up because you could use this like as a console bowl or whatever. So, but that is it, you guys. That is our haul for the week. Thank you guys for watching and we'll see you guys soon. Bye.